we create a data warehouse for business intelligence. This is a term business intelligence that's used so widely. And since we create a data warehouse for business intelligence, we of course now want to find out what actually is business intelligence. We want to define it and understand what it means and why we create a data warehouse for business intelligence. So business intelligence is made up of different strategies, procedures and technologies and infrastructures, such as for example, different tools that we use to create meaningful insights with data analysis. This means that we need to gather data, we need to manage and store data so that we can create meaningful insights with reportings, data visualizations, but also some more complex tasks such as data mining or predictive analytics. So what we are doing in business intelligence is we want to use and find raw data and transform this data in such a way that we can turn it into meaningful insights. So for example, as mentioned, we want to do data visualizations, reportings, and those meaningful insights we want to use to understand our company better and make better decisions in the future. And now how does a data warehouse fit in here? Well, the data warehouse is basically a very important component of business intelligence because we use this data warehouse as our data storage, but not only that, it's specifically for a centralized location of the structured data and the transformed data that we then can use to do our data visualizations, our reportings, and therefore it is one of the most important components of business intelligence. But you might also have heard of something that is called a data lake. So what is the difference between a data lake and a data warehouse? Because a data lake is also used to store data. And nowadays, this is a word that's used so commonly. And therefore, we also now quickly want to have a look at a data lake and what the difference is to a data warehouse. 